Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's Jennifer and today I actually have a helper, Ariana. She wanted to help me with my video today. But today is going to be all about my favorite beauty products from the Dollar Tree. Yes, the Dollar Tree. Um, pretty much my whole entire face today of makeup is from the Dollar Tree. But I wanted to do it outside because it is already 71 degrees. And um, it's only like 10 o'clock here in North Carolina. So it's nice outside. We're talking about beauty, and it's beautiful outside today, so it all goes together. Blanket. Oh, you had to get your blanket? Okay. It's 70 degrees outside. I don't know why she needs a blanket, but anyways, so today is all about that. Um, if you are new to my channel, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell anytime you know that I post a new video, as well as hit that like button for this video so I know to try to do more of these. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so today, um... The Bolero line. I am absolutely loving all of the Bolero. This is the Bolero face mask. This is the Watermelon Brightening Hydration Facial Mask. Um, I really like these. I just recently used uh, one of the other ones. is like coconut or something. Oh my gosh. These facial masks, they don't break you out or anything. They're great. Now, the, they got another line there that does break you out. And I don't like it. It's something I can't remember the brand of it but the Bolero go for the Bolero um, speaking of that as well as I have the uh, facial mist I like to spray this when I first get up in the mornings because it just something about it it gives me like this nice I guess because it's for hydration so then it wakes me up because it's kind of a cool mist and it smells good it's also the watermelon which is why I went with a watermelon face mask um, then they have the Bolero facial wipes. Um, these take off makeup really well. I have not had any issues with them at all. So I would try those out. Um, pretty much anything will come off. Even stuff that's supposed to be waterproof comes off with these. And they're very hydrated. Um, so when you take them out, very moist. Uh, when you take them out, they, they're not dry. And they've actually have had these open for about two weeks now and they're still very moist. Okay. The next thing is, um, this is for the Benefit Beauty Benefits uh, Liquid Liner. Today I don't have the Beauty Benefits on, but this one works extremely well. Um, so they have that one, um, and I'll go ahead and test it for you. You can see. Look how smooth that glides on. I mean, it's just great, and I mean. You can see it inside the bottle. It, it, it's moving inside the bottle. It's, well, you can't see it. I didn't have it in the camera. <laughs> but it's, this is some really good liquid eyeliner. But I also was able to find the um, hard candy liquid eyeliner there. So I actually have that on my eyes today. Uh, this is like the, it's called the tattoo maybe. It's a stroke by, stroke of gorgeous is what it's called. But it's the felt tip eyeliner with, in, Lash Enhancing Serum um, by Hard Candy. I know people are being able to find the Hard Candy stuff at the Dollar Tree, so I picked that up and it's really good. Okay. Um, the winged uh, liner brush is perfect for your eyebrows. Um, I picked these up because I had picked up the uh, liquid um, brow, brow gel. And so... Um, that's what I got those for, and it does really well with my eyebrows. So, um, the liquid brow cream gel looks just like this. It kind of reminds me of Maybelline's uh, line of stuff, and then the, this is what the cap looks like. Um, so, I just take the, the wee liner, and I dip it into here, and I'll get some on the brush, and then I'll take it, and I'll just do like this with it, and it just like outlines my eyebrows, and I'll just fill them in and everything. My eyebrows go so fast, and they're very precise now. Um, for some reason, it's just way better than the pencil, even though I still like the eyebrow pencil. But this, oh my gosh. I don't know why I was scared of it, the cream brow gel. I just guess I, guess I thought that it was going to be too much, but I really like it. Um, the next thing that I got is actually the eyeliner brow pencils. Uh, this is the eyeliner brow pencils. Not the same thing. Anyways, uh, these are the brow pencils uh, by LA Colors. Because um, LA Colors is actually their line. So, 
um, but it comes with the sharpener on it. It comes with a brow uh, enhancer as well on the other side, but I like this one a lot. So the days that I don't want to have my brows look completely like done done and I just want them to look more natural, I can use this and it's a lot better. Okay. Then I got the LA Colors um, Priming Mascara. I used that on my eyelashes yesterday as a, the white base and then added my mascara. It did wonders for my mascara, actually, surprisingly. I did not know how much you needed the white base. Baby, you already showed them your tooth that it's missing. <laughs> oh, oh, is that, it looks different outside? Yeah. It looks different outside. Anyway, so if you can pick up the LA Colors White Base Priming Mascara, pick it up from there. Um, the next thing that I got is the um, LA Colors Velvet Lip Mousse. Um, it's a lip color. Um, so it goes on, this one actually goes on matte. So it's really pretty. Um, I, I also like the Remy Rose brand. Um, but they can, these, these are like a little bit better. Um, so that, I put this in my favorites as the Velvet Lip Mousse. And this color, I don't remember what this color, oh, it's called Silky. I'm going to be right back. Okay, you be right back. Uh, this is called Silky. Uh, so if you can pick, find this, pick these up too. Then they have a contour uh, brush. These look like a more expensive brand. I can't remember the brand or anything. But they have their own line of the brushes that look like this. And this is the only one I've been able to find in any of my stores. But I have it. And I like how it makes the... Um, so if you do it this way, it makes the contour glide on really well. And then you can smooth it out with the same brush. Um, so I really like that. Then for my nails... I just put these nails on. I, I didn't put these nails on. These are my nails. I just painted my nails yesterday. And I'm kind of concerned with um, this color chipping this week. Because this is a, not the LA Colors brand color. Um, this is the Sassy and Chic. And I could tell whenever I was painting it on. It's a little bit thinner and not as good as the LA Colors brand. Because I had the white LA Colors brand on my nails for two weeks. And it was... so. It stayed on my nails the white did for two weeks without any chipping or anything And I think the reason it is is because the LA colors white was really good material material really good um, Thickness to it and so it kind of reminded me of like a gel polish um, But then I also had the rapid dry top coat. This stuff is awesome y'all Rapid dry top coat if you can find this in your store, please pick it up um they also have the base coat slash top coat from LA Colors. This too. So what I did on my nails for the two weeks that I didn't have any chipping is I had this on the bottom. And I did two coats of this. And then I did um, my two coats of my white polish. And then I did one coat of the rapid dry. And it didn't take very long for any of it to dry. I mean, I... I can't take very long for my stuff. I have a five-year-old, as you can see, and so she's always going, always moving and everything, so I can't usually take a bunch of time for myself. Um, so if it doesn't take long to dry, I know it don't take long to dry. Um, so, but pick these up. These are just <laughs> awesome and just wonderful, and I can't rave enough about their new base coat top coats and their rapid dry top coats. Just pick them up. Um, and then I like their 100% acetone nail polish remover. Um, it's only $1. You get the same size bottle you can pick up from Target or Walmart. So always go to the Dollar Tree first for nail polish and nail polish remover. Then, y'all, I tried the jar shampoo from Dollar Tree. I love it. Like, I am absolutely in love with their drive shampoo. It's a lot better price point. So it's a lot better price point. I keep having to stop the videos. So Y'all, I'm sorry. You don't know that. But if I repeat myself, it's because I'm stopping the video and having to restart. Because I keep getting interrupted. <laughs> Anyways. So, this is the dry shampoo uh, crisp. They also have Blossom. I really like both. Um, oh, my gosh. And it even has it on there where they compare it to the... The Tisty. 
She's talking about our dog, <laughs> Bessie. All right, so they compare this to one of the more expensive brand dry shampoos, and it's a very good comparable kind. I will forever, as long as they keep having these at the Dollar Tree, I'm going to actually be buying these now. Um, great. I even tried it in the last haul video where I picked them up, if you want to go check that out. <laughs> Um, the next thing that I have is the next thing that I have is the Beauty Benefits Pressed Powder. I really like this. This is a good another on the days I want to look a little bit more natural type powders. Um, it does have a decent coverage, but I put this on whenever I don't even use uh, anything on my face as far as foundation or BB cream. So this is really really good. Um, let me see if I can. Look, you can see that coverage right there. It's really light. My face for... I have no tan, y'all. None. But anyway, so that's got really, really good coverage. Um, but I like to use that, like I said, whenever I'm not using anything else on my face for a more natural look. Um, then they have the Beauty Benefits Contour Palette. So it comes with the lighter shade for your highlighter. And then it also comes with the darker shade for your, actually your contour. Um, so this is what it looks like I mean that's pretty great I can't get over how awesome these are as far as pigmentation um, I'm trying to so you can see the, these right here you can't see that one as well but it's because it's not supposed to need to and so um, I have the contour palette and that, so Beauty Benefits is a great, great brand. For the next thing that I have so that y'all can see the color and pigmentation on it, um, I'm going to actually use this on camera so you can see. I mean, it takes the stuff off right away. This is the facial wipes I was telling y'all about how you don't have any, I don't even have to press hard and all that's off my hand. I'm telling you, these are some of the, the best makeup wipes ever. Oh, smells so good too. These are the lavender and citrus. I don't think I told you that, but lavender and citrus, so they smell excellent. Excellent. Okay, so then I have the um, Sassy and Chic Moisturizing Foundation. Um, it's very rare I find my uh, hair, my hair colors. Uh, very rare I find my facial colors in anything at the Dollar Tree as far as the foundations and BB cream So I always pick them up when I do so I actually have a couple of these now because I found my color in the foundations So I'm gonna let you see what that looks like. They're real nice and creamy um, Right there So that's what it will that's what it looks like on your hand And I don't mind I'm um, swatching these and showing these y'all because one dollar I can I can do that. It's not like a ninety dollar foundation, but yeah, they're so creamy, and the coverage of that look. At, I mean, I know I put a lot on my hand, but the coverage is just unreal for one dollar. So that's the one thing I do like by Sassy and Chic. Uh, okay, and so then um, they have the BB cream. Uh, I'm a huge fan of BB cream, especially the natural days. Um, if I don't want to use just powder, I will use BB cream instead only. Especially during the summer whenever I get a tan and I don't have problems with acne, so I'm very, very lucky. So a lot of days I don't even wear anything, but on those days that, like in the summertime after I get a tan, I will get the BB cream and use that to give me a little bit of a touch. Uh, just as having a little bit of coverage. So here's the BB cream and I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like. Oh, I also... The beauty blender look at the springiness of the sponge is extremely soft it blends out the product really well and so I always like to um, mist it with my facial mist just to give it a little bit of moisture I'm telling you this stuff smells wonderful I could sit here and it's like air freshener almost it smells so good um, and so then Here's the BB cream. Sorry, y'all. You probably heard the dogs. <laughs> they don't want to be messed with, and Ariana keeps messing with them. <laughs> so, or they're playing with each other, and so all I hear is background noise and everything. Not a good morning for recording a video, but I couldn't help it. I'm ready to get this to y'all. So anyway, so this is the BB cream. 
and then it blends in extremely well. It just gives that little bit of a light coverage. And the, I'm telling you, this beauty blender, I absolutely love it. So, I mean, it just gave me a little bit of coverage on my hand. I mean, I absolutely love it. So, BB Cream, Dollar Tree, Sashi and Chic, pick it up. Uh, then the last thing that I have is actually the LA Colors Loose Powder. Again, if I can find it in my color, I'm buying multiples. I forgot to grab the um, loose powder I have open already in the bathroom, which I've already used it a pretty good bit, so it's just easier for me to open a new one anyways, because I'm going to have to have it open anyways. Um, and so the LA Colors, this is what it looks like when it comes in the package. It's just the LA Colors Loose Powder. Um, so, if I can get it out of the package, why can I not get it out? <sighs> what is up with my hair right there? Look at that. And y'all, I don't know who else. I'm only 32 and I have so many grays popping in. Stress, y'all. Stress. So, when you open it up, it comes like this. This one's a little bit, the, the plastic's a little bit up, which is fine because I drop it. I've dropped it like three times. Um, so anyway, so it has a little package, um, little plastic thing over the top. That's how you know it's completely brand new. And you pull that off and pull, pull it off the top. That way it completely opens up the powder. And then um, I like to just take my lid, put it on shaking around a little bit. And then it, that's what it looks like. So, and then you just dip your brush into that or what I like to do is I put like to put a little bit in my lid so that I don't have a huge amount come off onto the brush um, so then you can see that look at that pigmentation look at that color of the powder I mean it's unreal how great the LA colors brand is but anyway so that is it for the my favorites beauty haul from the Dollar Tree not haul I guess <laughs> but my favorite beauty products from the Dollar Tree let me know in the comments below what your favorite products today were from the Dollar Tree also what have you found at the Dollar Tree that you absolutely love that I didn't include in this haul so then maybe I can find it and try it out um, but again if you are new to my channel make sure to hit that subscribe button the notification bell so you know anytime I post a new video also hit the like button so I know to do more videos just like this again I'll see y'all soon bye